Hello, I'm Caroline from Incredible, and today I'm going to show you how to link your Squarespace store with our products. The Incredible app integrates with your store to automate order fulfillment, passing your customers' orders on to us as they're placed on your store. This leaves you plenty of time to focus on marketing your product and getting traffic to your website, whilst we handle the production and fulfillment to customers. To get started, you'll need a live Squarespace store and Incredible account. If you're not already registered, quickly sign up for our website now. The link's in the description below. Once you're registered, let's get started. So if you log into our website, click Profile and then click Integrations. Now you'll see all the platforms that we integrate with. Today, we're using Squarespace. So under the logo, click Link Your Store. Then click Activate Integration. After clicking this button, you should select your Squarespace site and then click Allow Permissions. And that's it, your Squarespace store is now integrated with Incredible. Before starting to link your products, you should fill in a brand profile if you haven't already. Having a brand profile means that we'll include a packing slip in your orders free of charge and you can include a thank you message to your customers. Link existing products to your Incredible account. If you already have products in your Squarespace store, then this process will show you how to link them to Incredible. If you don't have products yet, skip to the next section of the video and we'll show you how to create them from scratch. So the first thing to do to link your products is to make sure that your product is already set up correctly. So if you head to your Squarespace store, click Commerce and then click Inventory. You'll see all of your products listed here. So if you click into the product that you want to link, make sure that your title's filled in, that you've got a good product description and that your price is there. The stock quantity should be set to unlimited. Since we're printing on demand, we don't ever want this product to run out of stock. Make sure you create all the sizes and colors that you want to offer. So you can see on this one, I've created white in small, medium, and large. The last thing to do is to edit the weight of the product following the points in our shipping cost page. So on this one, we'll make the t-shirt 0.1 kilograms or 100 grams. Once your Squarespace product is ready, you can head back to our website and we'll link the product up. So if you head to Incredible and then click Profile, and integrations. You'll be back at the page with all of the integrations and so you need to click link products underneath Squarespace. You might want to bookmark this page since you'll be using it quite a lot to keep an eye on your product links. Underneath the product that you want to link, click edit. You'll see that this currently says not yet linked, which means we wouldn't receive any orders automatically. Now to link the product, first you need to click link in the top right corner and then type in the name of the product that you'd like to link it to. So for this product, we're just going to link it to the creator. Once you've selected the products that you'd like to link it to, you need to tick the boxes on the left-hand side. Once you've ticked the box on the left-hand side, you'll see more options appear on the right. So here, you need to select the right colour and size to make sure the orders come through correctly. All of mine are the colour white, which is already selected, so I just need to select the sizes. If you've got a different colour, like black or green, make sure to select the right colour here. Once you've selected all of the options and filled in the sizes and colours, scroll right to the bottom of the product. Here you'll see that there's a mock-up photo which has been imported from Squarespace. Make sure to tick this and then you'll see that it loads and adds it to the product on Incredible. Below this is the print file section. This is where you should upload your print file. Now when you link a product in this way, you need to make sure you're using a templated design file. We've attached the template in the description below so that you can go and template your file if you haven't already. Once you've uploaded the template to print file, click save and the product is now linked. You'll see that this now shows a green bar, 100% linked, which means any orders for this product will receive automatically. Next, we'll move on to how to create and import new products from our website to your Squarespace store. So the first thing you wanna do is find the product that you'd like to link to your store. So we're gonna click products and then t-shirts and we're just gonna upload the creator. Now on this page, we only need to fill in the color to see how our design looks on the mock-up. But size, brand and labels are really unimportant at this stage and we can select them again later if we need to. The main thing we need to do here is upload our design and position it on the mock-up, making sure that we're happy with it before we create the product. So I'm gonna upload this design and then check the quality of it once it's uploaded. You can see that this says 300 DPI, good quality. That's what you're looking for. If it shows lower quality than this, go and resave your design and make sure it shows good quality before proceeding. Once your design's been uploaded at good quality, click the little eye icon and check the preview. 
Here you can see what the t-shirt will look like once it's been printed. Once you're happy with the preview, click Create Product. This might take a little minute to save to your account. Once the product has opened up like this, you'll see four options underneath the product. You should click the one with the little arrow, and this means import. Once the import screen's loaded up, you need to import the title and the description that you'd like to be imported to your store. So this is gonna generate a new product listed on Squarespace automatically. On the left, you can also see the several mockups that our website has generated. Tick whichever one you'd like to upload. Now for the important bit. Make sure to select the color and sizes that you'd like to upload to your store. So on this one, I'm gonna upload white and baby blue. So I'll select white, and then select the little box on the top right corner. This will add all available sizes in the color white. And then do the same for any other color that you'd like to add. You'll see in this box on the right hand side is the imports variations. Make sure you've got everything in here that you'd like to import and then scroll down and click import to Squarespace. This process might take a minute since our website's now generating mockups and creating a new product listing on your store. You'll know when it's finished because the button will turn gray again and we'll say view on Squarespace. So we'll go ahead and click this once it's done. Now you can see this product's been uploaded to Squarespace and any orders received for this will come through automatically. That's it. Now you're all ready and set up to go with our Squarespace integration. Now that your products are linked, we'll receive your order details anytime an order's placed on your store. If you need any more help with the Squarespace integration, go and check out our other guru guides and also check out the help center. We have lots of information about the integrations in there. If you still have any questions, feel free to join in the conversation at our Facebook group, The Incredible Hub, or feel free to get in touch with us at support at See you next time.